Merry Christmas everyone! Hey, it's Keegan. Welcome back to my channel. Today's video we are doing a what I got for Christmas 2021. I'm gonna start this video off the same way every great what I got for Christmas video starts and that is with a disclaimer. I just wanted to say this is not at all me bragging. I was a little apprehensive about filming this video. The older I get the weirder it feels, especially everything going on in the world right now. I just didn't want to sound ungrateful and that all I thought Christmas was was about presents. So that's not at all what I think but I asked you guys on my Instagram. I think like 99% of you guys were like, please do it. I've done this video every year. I'll link all the other ones down below for you guys if you feel like going on a binge. I will watch these videos in July. Like, I'm not kidding. They're my favorite to watch. You guys asked me to do this video. I'm not at all trying to brag. Very thankful for everything that I got. Very thankful for all the people in my life. And I wanted to say to you guys, Merry Christmas. If you're spending Christmas alone, whether it's because of COVID or your flight got canceled or any reason that you're alone on Christmas, I just want to say that my heart goes out to you that you guys have been in my thoughts all day. I hope these videos are a nice little distraction from reality right now. To all of you guys I just wanted to say Merry Christmas and that I love you guys so so much and I'm gonna stop rambling but yeah please don't think I'm trying to brag because that's not at all what I'm trying to do I always start these videos off with my stockings and my stockings go hard Santa hooks it up with the stocking like tell me why I am more excited for my stocking than any other present like something about them just Mm. This is my stocking. It's like Sherpa. It's beautiful. Throughout the years of me doing this video, we've seen like a really like evolution of my stocking. <laughs> actually, you know what? I'm just gonna... I've actually already filmed this video before and I had to refilm it because of audio problems and the bells for my stocking were like a little annoying. We have all the stuff in my lap. I know the best thing to start with. When I went to the living room this morning, my stocking looks like this. I got ranch for Christmas. So this is Hidden Valley. Look, it's like a Christmassy one. If you guys are new to my channel, I recently learned that I like ranch. I'm 21 years old and for pretty much 21 years, I thought I hated ranch. And then I tried ranch. Like what? I tried it at a restaurant and I was like, wait, this is so good. And I've been on a ranch kick. And I asked you guys what your guys' favorite brand of ranch was. Everyone said the restaurant ranch, but if we can't get the restaurant ranch, a lot of people said Hidden Valley was really good. So I'm so excited to try this out. This will make a great addition to my fridge. Wait, do you refrigerate this? I don't know. Well, tell me if you refrigerate this. Also tell me your favorite things to dip ranch in because this is a new obsession. This is my hyper fixation of the moment. This was like something that I was so happy for. So thank you, Santa. The older I get, the more excited I am about things like ranch. Another thing that I got, oh my God, this is another obsession of mine, Reese's trees. If you guys watch my videos as well, you know, you know the obsession. The trees, the pumpkins, the hearts, the eggs, the eggs, the eggs are the best. Reese's are my favorite candy, but the holiday, it just hits different. I also got some of my stocking that I already ate, so. Oops, I'm so obsessed. Thank you, Santa. Another thing in my stocking, I got these scrunchies. I love scrunchies. And I have a lot of like the bigger scrunchies and sometimes they like show up in hairstyles. So I was actually so glad when I got like the thinner ones because I could do hairstyles and not have them show up. Another thing that I got was this antibacterial protection kit. It comes with four gloves, two masks, and 10 antibacterial hand wipes. I don't think I talked about this, but I had a family member that had COVID. So initially I was going to spend COVID alone in my apartment. They ended up testing negative on Christmas Eve, which was fantastic. We're still wearing our masks, social distancing all of that just to be safe this really goes with the theme of a covid christmas i'm so glad that i'm not alone on christmas and again if you guys are because of covid my heart goes out to you i just want to hug you guys but if you have covid i don't want to hug you air hugs bring it in. Very thankful for that. I'll probably put that in my car. The L'Oreal Lash Paradise Mascara. You guys know I love this mascara. I also got this necklace. It says she believed she could, so she did. And it's really cute. It looks like a wine bottle, like low-key. My mom accidentally bought 20 of these. San Santa accidentally bought 20 of these. From my understanding, it's a charger for your Apple Watch when you're on vacation. If you guys don't know, I've been teasing that I was going on a really fun trip with someone really special. I recently like announced to you guys that I have a boyfriend and we were gonna go to Spain. Me and my boyfriend were going to go to Spain for New Year's. We ended up canceling the trip. We just didn't feel like it was safe and the right thing to do with all the COVID cases. We actually rescheduled our trip to go to a completely different place. We're going to two different places. It's the number one travel destination on my bucket list and the other one's the number one travel destination on his bucket list. And we're going after we graduate college in May. Oh my God, I like kind of just stuttered when I was like, oh, I'm graduating. This will be great for when we eventually go. So if you guys have any guesses of where we're going, leave it down below. These are the best pencils, the Papermate pencils, literally the best. Sour Patch Kids. Sour Patch Kids are my favorite like sour candy and then like the Reese's like holiday candy are my favorite chocolate candy. I also got these fuzzy socks. You can never go wrong with a pair of fuzzy socks. These ones are aloe infused and I have no idea how they infuse the aloe. If anyone knows, let me know. I'm always very curious, but I love a good pair of fuzzy socks. This, oh, this fell. Oops, I broke this. Um, oops. This is a little sheet mask. It's a brightening sheet mask from Burt's Bees and then it also comes with a little chapstick along the theme of my mom has COVID. 
it is an antibacterial hand sanitizer spray. More Reese's Trees. I just love them, guys. I just, they're just so good. I also got this hand lotion, a moisturizing hand lotion. It has vitamin E in it. And a Starbucks gift card, which I'm so excited about. I love getting Starbucks in between class. I go to Arizona State. If you guys don't know, I'm a senior. I'm graduating this year. <laughs> oh my, dude, you just hear that screech? Wow, I did not know I could make that high pitch of a sound. I also... I also got this little measuring cup, and at first I was like, is this a shot glass? And I was like, how is it in a... I'll spill but it's actually just like a really cute little measuring cup and it's adorable I honestly did not realize that like a fourth cup is this small like I always thought a fourth cup was a lot bigger I love this and I kind of want to use it as a shot glass oh another thing that I got that was in my stocking was this suede protector it's like a little spray that you can put on shoes or anything make it waterproof I had a pair of suede boots that I wanted to wear to Spain and I didn't want to get them dirty I'll still be using this on the suede boots because I bought them this was another Christmas present so thank you so much Santa for my presents and my stock I love my stocking. Where do we go from here? Oh, okay, we'll start with this. My family has a tradition that we open one Christmas present on Christmas Eve, and when I was younger, we never did this, and I wish we would have done this when I was younger. We started doing this when I was a little older, but it's always a pair of pajamas. A lot of you guys say that you also have this tradition. This year, these actually don't fit me, so I didn't wear them. I think they're really cute. They're these green and white striped pajama shorts. They're actually really soft. Apparently, they didn't have my size, and then they were like, oh, this could my fit, but it didn't. And then also just like a black long sleeve shirt to go with it. We'll exchange these and get my right size because I think they're really cute. Another thing that I got, my mom got me this scarf because I was supposed to go to Spain. I'm from Arizona. I literally bought this from H&M. I'm not from Chicago. So the coldest weather that I've ever been in is like 40 degrees. I think that's cold. I was gonna go to Spain and it's obviously a little colder. So my mom got me this super cute scarf. Again, we canceled Spain, but I'm sure I will wear this. I think that I know where I want to wear this too, but I think it's really pretty and cute. I also got this. So this is a plug-in heater along with the I don't do well with cold theme. It's a little heater that you just plug into the wall and then there's like a timer so you can set it for how long you want it to heat up your room. I think it's super cool. My sister also got one and she used it and she said it does really great. Awesome. So I'm really excited to use this. I always want to know like who comes up with this stuff because I wish it was me. I also got this shampoo. This is a detoxifying shampoo from Way. I believe this is a Kardashian's hairstylist hair care line. I've heard really great things about this. I don't have a detoxifying shampoo and I just like wanted to like detoxify my scalp with like all the dry shampoo and build up. Sometimes I I feel like shampoo and conditioner just doesn't do. Let's see if it smells good. Something about it reminds me of my childhood, but I don't know. Part of me thinks it smells like that spray, like the L'Oreal like no tear spray or no tear. The whole time I thought it was no tear, but it was no tear. Like that detangler spray. You guys know. You know if you know. The girls that get it, get it. Okay. <laughs> Another thing that I got is a hairspray. This is my favorite hairspray and I ran out of it. I didn't want to pay for it. I was just lazy. I didn't feel like paying for it. It's from Kevin Murphy. It's a do-over dry powder hairspray. Do you guys want to hear the absolute drama that was this hairspray? Obviously, I curled my hair today and I wanted to hairspray it and I could not find this. My entire family searched our whole house for it. I searched through all my Christmas presents, my bedroom, my sister, my mom, my stepdad, they all searched through their Christmas presents. We went through the trash. We're like, oh, maybe it got thrown away with like the wrapping paper. It was under the coffee table. It must have like drolled under the coffee table. But yeah, so this caused a lot of drama for a good 30 minutes in my household today. So everyone her. She's a moment. Another thing that I got was this tongue scraper. I really wanted this. I saw it on TikTok and I was like, I want that. You can use your toothbrush to like scrape your tongue, but it makes me gag a little bit. So I wanted to get this. So thank you, mom. This is another hair thing that I got. It is the Olaplex hair rescue kit. I really love Olaplex. I think they have great products. This comes with the number zero, three, four, and five. Really just love their products. They have really helped my hair a lot. I recently cut my hair. My mom used to have like the driest, frizziest, most damaged hair and she started using Olaplex. Her hair is popping off a whole 180. She did that. It also comes with travel size of the shampoo and conditioner, which I thought for eventually when I go on my trip, that would be great to bring along because sometimes they don't give you shampoo and conditioner in hotel rooms. My sister got me this tumbler cup. She got it from Etsy. If you guys don't know, I am a huge, 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 huge Taylor Swift fan and it has all of her albums on it. Like this is just the cutest thing. Like look at reputation. Oh, it's just beautiful. This is gonna be my cup like I'm gonna drink my alcoholic beverages out of this I'm gonna be drinking my water my protein she like this is everything everything I love it so thank you so much to my sister she also got me a few other gifts she also got me this from Taylor Swift's website apparently it was delivered yesterday like literally yesterday it is this beautiful oversized shirt it has her little face on it I just 
oh, I love her. I feel like this will be my shirt. Like, do you know everyone has that shirt that like, ew, that's kind of gross. Like you should really stop wearing that. This is gonna be mine that I like hibernate in. This will be my, I don't know what I'm gonna wear today. I wanna become, like every time that I'm like, hmm, what should I wear today? This is the shirt. This is the shirt. It's also so soft. It's also very big. So I feel like it'll be like a nice oversized comfy shirt. I just love it. it also got me a phone case from Case Defy. My phone case is damaged. It's the Apple one. I wouldn't recommend it. Every time I drop it, just like chunks of my phone case fall off. I don't even know how that makes any sense, but it does. So she got me this phone case from Case Defy. It's plaid. I think it's really cute, really pretty. I think it's gonna look really good on my phone. Thank you so much to my sister. I love all of it. I love the Taylor Swift stuff. Like, <laughs> just love Taylor Swift. My mom got me these sunglasses. I actually already own these sunglasses and I wanted to get another pair of them because the ones that I had just kind of been like thrown around, they weren't in the best shape. They're from Amazon and they're Celine sunglasses dupe. When I wear these sunglasses, someone needs to stop me because I feel rich. I know these are $15 Amazon sunglasses, but I feel like a rich woman. I feel like I have a trust fund. You know those TV scenes where people are like walking down to like, you know, and it's like, mm -mm. I don't even know if that makes any sense. My stepdad's mom, so I guess my step grandma got me these really cute pair of socks. She also got me an ornament and a gift card. My mom's mom also got me an ornament and a gift card, but these socks are so cute. So thank you to you guys. I got some workout tops. These are from Amazon. These are my favorite workout tops ever. They're basically like a Lululemon dupe. I love them. They're such a better price. These are so flattering on me. I actually own the white and the black already. I think I own like a pink one too. And like, I own, and like a tie-dye one. I don't, I own a couple of these. These are just my favorite and I wanted to ask for more so I didn't have to do my laundry as often. Quite literally just of laziness but they're just so flattering they're such a great price they're my favorite to work out in I also got the black I just feel like black and white go with every legging that I have I wanted to get extra ones of those they're just so good you guys if you guys don't have them already check them out they're so good my mom accidentally got me two hard drives <laughs> so this is Toshiba it's the two terabyte hard drive basically what happened was she bought two of these by accident and I opened one and I was like if I just broke that, I opened one, I was like, oh, thank you so much. And then I opened another one and I was like, wait, what? <laughs> she accidentally bought me two, but I think it worked out really well. Her and I were talking about this because we we're like, do we return it? Do we not? I've broken my hard drive three times this year. I think I've had three separate hard drives because I keep breaking them. So she was like, you know, it might be a good idea to have a backup. And if I don't break it, which I really hope I don't, knocking on wood. I will just use the next one next year, but these are really great hard drives. If you guys make YouTube videos, I highly recommend editing on hard drive because I just have really bad luck with technology. Let's be real here. You guys know my computer breaks, my hard drives break, everything breaks. I also got another YouTube thing. So this is like a little thing for your tripod. So I have an iPhone tripod, but it's not the best. It's kind of wobbly. My phone's always crooked on it. Adapter thing, put your phone on. If you guys make TikToks, highly recommend it. I have like a sturdy tripod for my camera and this is just like a little adapter that you can put your phone on it. So I wanted to get this so I can make like more TikToks and things like that. I really have been trying to make more TikToks. I've really been trying. My mom accidentally bought me two of another thing. So this is the year of double. The Christmas of double, the same thing. My mom bought me two handheld tripod. That actually really hurt. It like hit my... Wow. Oh. They're both from Manfrotto. The tripod that you're currently sitting on is from Manfrotto, but it's like more of like the bigger one. This is a handheld one. I actually already have this one, but I've had it for a couple of years that the little grips at the bottom have rubbed off. So every single time that I set my camera up, it goes like it'll open up more and sometimes it falls just because there's no grip. She also got me this one. So this is like more of like a bougie one. My friend Lauren has this one. This one you can extend it. It's just like more like heavy duty. Like this is like the daughter and this is like the mom. You know, you know how it is. The one that you're currently on I guess would be the grandma, the matriarchy. Thank you so much, mom. I definitely will be using both of them because if I want a shorter tripod or a taller tripod, I have options. Another thing that I got, I got this blanket. This is from QVC, according to my mom. So if you guys want to check it out, I think it's really cute, really soft. It reminds me of like the Barefoot Dreams blankets. Ooh, it's in Smoky Zebra. Okay, pop off. Apparently, this is more like a cape. It reminds me of like a giant scarf. So apparently, it's supposed to keep your arms warm and it's really soft. So thank you so much, mom. I think we've gotten to our last one. I'm pretty sure. I asked for some studio lights. I literally am in awe that they fit in this tiny little box. I asked for studio lights. The studio lights that I'm currently using are like one use away from catching my house on fire. So I feel like this is a gift that everyone can be thankful for that I will not have the fire department here today. The studio lights
pads that I currently use, I've had them since I was 14 or 15. I'm 21 now. They are honestly on the verge of catching on fire at all times. So I wanted to get these ones. These ones are smaller. They're more compact. I hope that they won't catch my house on fire. I did drop them like pretty, pretty hard though. Like they, it was a pretty big fall. So I really hope they were. I always just want to... Oh, I caught that. Thankfully. I always, of course, want to improve my videos for you guys. That is everything that I got for Christmas, I think. Oh my gosh. Wait, 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 wait. My friend just sent me this. Lover is my favorite Taylor Swift album. Look what she got me. It's like all the sound waves of Lover. Like, why is this like, the nicest gift that anyone's ever given me? Like, I literally screamed when I saw this. Thank you, Tori. Like, I literally love it. Like, I'm shaking how much I love it. But yeah, that is everything that I got for Christmas. Once again, I hope this did not come off as bragging. I am so thankful for everything that I got and all the people in my life. And you guys, I am so thankful for you guys. I just want to say, you guys have made this the best year. You've made every year the best year. From the bottom of my heart, I'm just so thankful for you guys. And I really love the community that we have built. And I feel like you guys are my friends and my family. My favorite people to go to and talk to. And I just could cry right now i just love you guys and i hope that you guys are having a merry christmas again if you guys are alone on christmas or if you're missing a loved one or anything like that where this day isn't the best day of your entire life i just want to say my heart goes out to you and you guys are always in my thoughts i'm just i just love you guys and i wish that i could physically hug every single one of you and just wish you a merry christmas individually you guys are everything to me and i just love you and i'm gonna stop talking also if you're not subscribed feel free to subscribe i'd love to have you here i love you so much merry christmas i'll see you in my next video